There's no fooling around when Terry Peters hits the gym. Terry is 60 years old. He's a competitive CrossFit athlete, and he has no plans on slowing down. I honestly feel that you know, our bodies are meant to move, you know, and we should move. And if I inspire somebody to get off the sofa and uh, you know uh, go and do something, you know, I'm. Feel uh, pretty good about that. He can be stubborn and uh, and really, really, really just push hard and 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 kind of you know very focused, very determined. And I mean that's why his nickname is Bull because he's he's literally like a bull. Put something in front of him and he'll just go through it. The bull has been active his entire life. 30 years ago, it was Taekwondo that satisfied his physical side. He became a fourth degree black belt and then migrated into cardio kickboxing. It was in his 50s when Terry fell in love with CrossFit. The, the gym where I was uh, coaching at, uh, the owners uh, had gotten interested in CrossFit themselves for their own personal training and decided to bring it in as part of the programming and so uh, I gave it a, a try and it kicked my ass. And so I thought, I got to get on board with this. It wasn't long before Terry decided he wanted to compete. He entered the CrossFit Open competition in 2012. He ended up placing 15th in the world in his age group. That many qualified for the CrossFit Games in Los Angeles. It is the Super Bowl of CrossFit. There, you know, it's totally different. Now you got much bigger crowds. You got TV cameras on you the whole time you're competing, and uh, it was really something. Terry came 14th place, and now he is determined to qualify again and achieve an even better result. So I'm pretty motivated this year. I'll be going into the next division, which is 60 plus. So uh, I'm looking forward to being in the, the younger side of the division rather than the top end. But that's my goal: is to get back. And uh, my ultimate goal: I'd, I'd like to be on the podium. I do believe that this year he. Has has a legitimate shot at hitting the podium at the CrossFit Games. He's he's been sort of the old guy in the younger bracket. When you're 59 competing against 55 year olds, it makes a difference. Now he's 60 competing against 61, 62, 63, 64, 65 year olds. This is probably the year where he has his best shot. Question. Here it comes. How does it feel to have a 60 year old? Fitter than the two of us. That man is an inspiration. <laughs> wow, and you're a CrossFitter. I mean, you're way. Used to be, used to be, because it's so easily to get injured. So the fact that uh, you have the form of good coaching. I know Dave Kitchen from back in the day. Here, here, here he's a great coach. Uh, phenomenal story. And if Terry Peters takes it to the CrossFit Games, the Super Bowl of CrossFit, wouldn't that be something? I'm going to stick to hiking with the dogs because that all looked way too hard for me. No, yeah. but challenge yourself, athletes. I like it. And we're calling all athletes, coaches, managers, and parents. Breakfast Television is now accepting nominations for BT's Athlete of the Week.